Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. I hope that you're having a really great day. Today we are going to trash talk. It looks like I got a lot of trash, so we need to get busy. I've said it before, but I don't mind saying it again. This doesn't mean I used all these products in one month. It means that I finished them in the month of January. So first off, one of my favorite things, this guy right here. Oh, I love, I love, love, love this stuff so much. It just makes my skin feel so good. It smells so good and the smell lingers so nicely because I really do. I really do love it. I went through a Hoagie's wipe. I think I have one more. I think I have one more. Running out of them. I love those so much. They're really, really nice. I hate, hate that they discontinued them. Um, this is Hawaiian Silky Miracle Worker 14 and 1. I used to use this all of the time. I was going through some of my hair care products and realized that this had expire but it is really good and I will probably rebuy that and give it another try because I do know that I did enjoy it it's one of those products that you can put even in your scalp area because it is seriously for so many things let's see here let's read it is a no drip activator moisturizes your hair defines curls softens hair edge shine smooths dry scalp reduces breakage and strengthens for healthy weave and braids, repairs chemically damaged hair, non-greasy, detangles, increases body thermal protection, and helps relieve, born, helps relieve burning sensation. I don't like what using it because I have to go through and if I see somebody show me something, I've got to try it too. But this really is a good product. Yeah, so I probably will try that again when I use up some of the stuff I have. This is a Arvenzella, an Arvenzella, Arvenzella, a hydrating argan oil mask, professional series, deep cleans and hydrates for softer, silkier and healthier looking hair. And oh, I did have a little tiny bit there. I got this is off of Amazon. It had some really good reviews. This was actually on one of those. I'm sure you have seen them on Facebook. Every once in a while, you'll see these 25 greatest beauty products from Amazon. And then you go through this slideshow and it has the link. Yeah, I did that. But um, it was nice. I didn't really notice anything. I didn't notice anything that different with my hair. I love the macadamia. Y'all know, I've, I've talked about it all the time. The brown with the green, the best that I've used so far. Now I haven't used this guy yet, so we will see. I did finish this finally. This is a Pantene Pro-V uh, moisturizing cleansing conditioner. I used this up. I had probably this much left and I just didn't use it as much with blonde hair and I don't know why. But I really, I really wish I would have. I think I would have seen a difference because I could tell a difference when I started using the moisturizing or the cleansing conditioners, however you want to say it. But I, I do like this one. I like this one a lot. Um, but I used that one up. I also used up this cocktail dress shower gel. It was yummy. I love this. It smells so nice. Crystal Peonies, Bright Mandarin, Sheer Cedar, and Velvet Musk. Get through some lashes. The LA Collar. The LA Collar's Dramatic Lash in Delightful. I used up one of those. The Cream in 0605. Very nice. I'm just kind of grabbing as we go. Uh, Pixie Glow Tonic. I did repurchase. I purchased the mommy. This is the baby. I bought the mommy. Love it. This is a Vitafusion Power C immune support gummy. I did repurchase and they're about half gone. 
I ate them like crazy to prevent myself from getting sick when it was so, so cold outside. And they worked like a charm. I have half a jar sitting in there that I have not touched. And I will not rebuy again because I'm doing keto right now. And these are how many? Four, four grams of carbs. My gummy vitamins, my multivitamins, they're three. It's ridiculous. Like, I could go to Wendy's and get a Baconator, no ketchup, no bun, which I just take the bun off because then they have to package it weird. Take the bun off, no ketchup, and it's three grams of carbs versus the 38 with the ketchup and the bread. So I would rather have a Baconator, no buns, no ketchup, than two gummy bears gummy gummy vitamins gummy bears okay this is the clear care bonus hydroglide y'all know we'll leave it there <gasps> these are so good these are vitafusion everyday energy um there's 40 in here how many carbs are in this guy Oh my gosh. I have a brand new bowl of these. They taste like you're eating peaches. They're so good. 10 grams of carbs. 8 sugars. I will not be buying those again. Here's my adult gummies and I hate to swallow big vitamins, but I'm just going to have to get over it. I'll get one of those pill cutters and cut them. Adult gummies, biotin. I will not buy these anymore for the same reason. Four grams of carbs. I used up a vanilla bean Noel. This is a staple with my whole family. My girls have always loved this. I love this. My mom uses it. My sister, you know, she uses it on herself and my sister. It's wonderful. I used up a Nioxin Scalp Therapy Conditioner for Fine Hair, number four. I did like this a lot. I don't know if I will rebuy it because I'm really into the cleansing conditioners with the chocolate hair going on so we'll see i scraped every little bit out of this guy that i could which color is this i think it's light yes this is light and i tried to pull that little plunger thing out of there and i just couldn't like nothing comes out on here anymore it's it's pretty much empty yeah it's pretty much empty i love this one of my favorite concealers ever, ever, ever. I already have another backup of the light, so it lasted a long time. This is from, oh, what is the brand? What is the brand? What is the brand? Butter London. And this is the, one of their eyes. Oh my gosh, it was so pretty. It was such a pretty color, but it dried up like it's supposed to be whipped and it it dried up it's no good okay it wasn't as full as it looks i have some makeup bags in here i have some different cosmetic bags let me dig these on here okay okay i'll see you you are so beautiful okay i used up a mary k time wise replenishing vitamin c i really do like this i will eventually buy this again i am going to use up the um drawer full of vitamin c all the skincare stuff that i got at marshall's and tj maxx i want to use that up before it expires because a lot of that stuff has kind of a short expiration on it. But then yes, I will I will rebuy that because I do like it. Okay. 
uh, I used up a cream number 43. This is a, let's see, Amazing Shine. This is the 311T. I love these lashes. I remember that. I love those. I love, love, love those lashes. LA Colors. This is a, D this was a Diva Lash I used. This was another Delightful. And this was a Cream 702. I believe that is the dupe for the MAC. I forget the number, so I'm just not going to say it. I finished up a Shea Moisture 10 in 1 Renewal System. I really do like this mask as far as a drugstore version. I think it's a really, really good one. Shea Moisture has some really awesome things. I used up my last Hope in a Tube Philosophy. This is for eyes and lips. Um, I probably had another three days in there, but I lost the lid. I lost the lid to this and I was afraid. Like I used it for a couple more days, but then like maybe I don't. Uh, I was just afraid to since it didn't have a lid. I need a drink. I'm sorry. Half time. I finished up my Urban Decay Anti-Aging Primer. I do have a backup of this. I have one eye primer that I want to finish using before I go into, before I break into the replacement for this, just because I've had it for a while. I finally finished up this. This is the NYX Professional Precision Brow Pencil. It's the one that comes and it looks like it's a dark, ooh. Um, it has the square like pinched applicator to go in there with your brows. I really did like this. I have, I'm not kidding you, L'Oreal, Maybelline, e.l.f. I have so many backups. I'm not going to be buying brow product. I'm not going to be buying brow products for a while, but when I do, I would really consider this one. This one, actually, I just filmed what's in my makeup bag. Um, and this was in it and it is totally dry. It's totally dry. Like, oh, and it just worked. <laughs> I just marked all over my hand. I just marked all over my hand in that video and it did nothing. It's dry though. It's dried up. I have replacements. I have backups. I have one open now. Uh, I used up a brulee. This is the Revlon. In that video, I talked about my Jordana Twist and Shine lippies that I keep in my vehicle all the time. And I didn't have one in for a while. I didn't have one in for a while because I used this from Revlon. This was the clear one that I used. And I used it like... It was scraping it off my lips that much. This was okay. It felt good when you first applied it, but it didn't stay. And it, I, my lips just didn't feel hydrated. So this is a dip brow pomade from Anastasia. This is in chocolate. I think this is the one that dried out. Yeah, it's, I've had it a long time. This is a... Essence Lash Princess. This is the Sculpted, I think. Yes, Sculpted Volumizing. It was just, it was done. It was done. It was tired. It needed to go. I used up a Revlon Eyelash Glue. I finished a Age Rewind in Light. There, sorry. And this is a NYX Liquid Eyeliner. And this thing does not like me. I wanted to run over this with my vehicle. <laughs> you know when you're going for a certain look and you are there and then you go in with an eyeliner and it messes everything up? That's enough to set people crazy. It is. I'm like, leave me alone! My eyeliner played me! Okay, I think that is it. I thank you all so very much for hanging out with me, doing some trash talk, listening to my many reviews on how these products worked for me. I hope that you have a wonderful and blessed day, and I will see you in my next video.